Good afternoon. My name is Megan Mickler and I am in year five. I am here to talk to you about chickens. I have three backyard chickens, Isabella, Alice and Lulu. As the keeper of chicken, I know that chickens like to spread their wings out, roost, lay their eggs in the nest, scratch and have dust bombs. They do all of these things every day. You probably don't notice, but there are actually three types of eggs you can buy from the supermarket. There are free range eggs, barn laid eggs, and caged eggs. Free range eggs come from chickens that live a bit like my chickens, free to run around. Barn laid eggs come from chickens that live in barns, but caged eggs come from chickens that live their whole lives in tiny cages. Because of this, they can't do any of the things they like to do. They are not even able to stretch their wings, not even once for their whole entire lives. Basically, they are living in misery. Felicity Shand from the RSQCA tells me that there are over 10 million chickens living like this today. The farmers who keep these chickens in tiny cages are protected by a code of practice law. That means they are allowed to, because our government lets them do this. I believe keeping chickens in cages is unfair, and other countries have already outlawed caging chickens. I want the Australian government to change this law too, so that if we use chickens for eggs, they should still be allowed to do the things they love and behave the way chickens like to behave. I am only one kid, so I need your help. I'm trying to get as many kids and families as I can to send a letter to the Federal Agriculture Minister, Joe Ludwig, asking him to change this law. It will take a lot of letters. So, when you go home today, please chat with your parents about this cause. And if you would like to make a difference, then please write a letter to the Minister too. There will be a special note in this week's newsletter explaining how you can help. There is also a cool website called kidsagainstcages.com. Also, when you buy eggs, make sure they are not called caged eggs. If people stop buying them, then the shops won't stock them anymore, and this will help chickens too. At the moment, the cheapest free-range eggs only cost $1.21 more. Don't forget to talk to your family tonight and look for the note in the newsletter. Thank you for listening.